Welcome to today's class, escrow issues. It is good for one hour of mandatory CE in uh, the real estate world and title. So I thank you for being here. I am Raymond Modulin, the director of Real University. If you've got questions today, in the class here, feel free, you guys can ask questions anytime. If you're at home listening, feel free to email me at raymond at realuniversity.com if you have questions. Uh, we are going to be talking about an in-depth look at how the escrow works in the title insurance, real estate, and financing environment. All right? So the term escrow is part of the settlement process, but many of you don't know there are actually different meanings for the word escrow. Part of that is you are going to have to understand who you're talking to. So we're going to talk about the different types of escrow, how to establish it, the pros and cons, the problems with escrow, the steps of escrow, and we're going to examine some of the documents and the specific wording necessary to complete this course and what escrow means, all right? So we'll have a little bit of an introduction. We'll talk about what escrow accounts are. We're gonna talk about common escrow issues, violations, and how you guys can avoid them. We're gonna talk a little bit about some of the do's and don'ts for closing escrow. We'll talk about how people can file claims against escrow or in case there are issues. Then we'll follow up with purchase and escrow agreements and what we mean by them. And then we'll have a couple of minutes of Q&A uh, for this class. So please stick around. Like I said once before, this course is two, uh, one hour. Almost said two, but it's not. It's one hour of continuing ed credit. And I am Raymond Modulin, so hold on, let's get started. <laughs> 